What's up everybody? Sun just went down and I'm out here gonna do something a little bit scary for me. First time pumpkin grower. Uh, but a necessity I think. And uh, you can tell me all if I've done wrong down in the comments uh, after this. But here's what we're gonna do. This is my little pumpkin that isn't so little anymore. And he's in a bad spot. And he's really close, as you can see there, uh, to where the vine's buried. Um, so I think I'm going to go ahead and cut him off. And I've got another little pumpkin over here started that I can still move this vine pretty easily. Uh, I can get him up on a pallet. So I'm going to cut this guy off. And we're going to put all our energy into this one here. And we're going to get him up on a pallet and on some sand. And then I think I'm going to go ahead and deadhead off this plant because this plant is roughly, I would say, about 18 to 20 feet long. Uh, I measured it at this pumpkin uh, the other day and it was about 16. So I'd say that's probably about four to five foot there uh, past him. So we're probably knocking on 20 foot easily. As you can see, you got some male plants in there blooming and starting to come out here. Some of these longer vines, secondaries, I'm probably going to check them, uh, see roughly how long they are uh, when they hit. I'm going to go out to 10 feet. A lot of people say 8 feet, and then they kind of uh, cut them off also uh, just to promote more growth uh, but I think I'm gonna let those secondaries go a little bit longer just because they're gonna be fueling the growth that will be this little pumpkin right here so I'm gonna go ahead gonna cut him off and then I'm going to determine roughly where I want to cut that vine it's been about six days now since the, that last clip you've seen, and there's been some major changes on the pumpkin. I did go ahead and trim it off, so I'll go ahead and show you what we've got uh, now from this little pumpkin. It isn't so little anymore. So I went ahead and measured this before I cut it. It actually ended up being uh, 21 feet it's all the way out to the pumpkin, or out to the vine. Uh, where the pumpkin was and then it was actually 19 feet across this way so working with about a 20 by 20 plant but i went ahead and i did cut off the main vine and i cut him off right here at the edge of the pumpkin so he's really grown quite a bit in the last uh, little bit i mean he's probably five times the size he was earlier uh, I haven't got him up on my pallet yet. I got it kind of situated here. Uh, I'm going to put some cardboard down over the top and then the sand on top of that. Uh, and then I'll be placing the pumpkin on top of it. But right now, that's where we're at after uh, six more days of growth. Uh, I've been dead heading off some tertiaries or at least cutting them off if they've started. Um, and then just going around trimming what can be trimmed I had a couple dead leaves up by the stump so I cut them off also a big problem that I'm having right now is there's a lot of squash beetles in here I've been seeing them on some of the male flowers I really like them so gonna be out here probably spraying I see one going across the leaf there right now maybe you could see him he flipped over the side there but gonna go ahead keep plugging away at it but not a whole lot to report gonna probably get that pumpkin up on that pallet this afternoon uh, gonna have the wife help me uh, get it up on there and we'll have it all set to go and then I've also been dosing with some micronutrients and I ran out of my fertilizer I've been using so I had to order some more uh, and I grabbed some 18, 18, 21 to tie me over for just the last couple days uh, that I've fertilized. So we should be back in order uh, probably tomorrow. And we'll be really, uh, really working away at this plant, trying to put some uh, size on that pumpkin. Uh, it's grown a lot in the last six days, as you've seen there. 
and I'd say going on uh, I think we can I think we can get up t to a good size uh, I've been shooting for a thousand pounds this entire time uh, will we get there I don't know I hope so uh, but I think we'll make it to at least a few hundred pounds uh, but stay uh, stay tuned uh, follow along like subscribe the channel and I'll see you in the next one bye bye